What's up everybody? I'm Rob and welcome back to my channel. As a request, I'm going to have to Angelica Hill perform a cover up. I'll be there on the Today Show. And this is actually right after she was on AGT, so if she looks younger, that's why. But with her, age is just a number when she gives a beautiful performance. So let's get to it. 10 year old singer Angelica Hale first captured our hearts last year when she made it all the way to the finals on season 12 of America's mm -hmm. Got more recently, Angelica wowed audiences again with her incredible voice and charm Aww. on the season three premiere of Little Big Shot. Today, we're so lucky because oh look my who gosh. came to see us. Oh. A little pint-sized powerhouse. She's here with another unforgettable performance. We're so happy to we see so you. Pint-sized powerhouse? Yeah, that's actually a pretty good way to describe her. <laughs> now, before you guys ask me any questions, yeah. I'll ask you. Okay. I heard you had a fantastic voice, so... Oh! Cats bust. You know what? She busted me out. You know what? <laughs> I don't have a good voice. Yes, you do. I'm a mouther. Do you no, know what a mouther a stomper. is? Stomper. A mouther. So she's a lip sinker. Oh. Thank you for asking me that. Your life is a whirlwind. Oh. <laughs> Aww. Your life is a whirlwind, isn't it? Yes, it is. Are you having the best year of your life? Best All ten year. of them? This is the year, guys! <laughs> you know what? It's the year for another reason, too. I see you have a little baby sister over yes, there. Yes, that What's is her right. Name? Her name is Abigail Madeline Hale, and to Aww. be precise, I named her middle name. You did? So oh my I gosh. Did. And you are the very first. I have to admit, I think it's a great, I think it's great that Angelica gave her little sister her middle name because when a child gets a younger sibling, I know Angelica is older and average to become an older sibling, but I just think that it's great that she got that chance because it could be hard on the older sibling. That way, that gives them a little bit more control and makes it easier to adapt to that new situation. I hope that makes sense, but anyway, let's continue. Ambassador too, aren't you, for the, the national? Yes, the very first kid ambassador of the National Kidney Foundation. Because you, you actually got a kidney wow. from your mom when you were yes. just four years old, yes. and now wow, look you at are you. a living miracle, sweetheart. Right. You what are you going to sing for us? Well, today I'm going to be singing I'll Be There by the Jackson oh, 5. Yeah, That's the right. one I was hoping Yay. for. Thank, Thank you. you. Good choice. You and I Here we go. Rock the bat, beautiful. Wow. One person, and I'm already impressed with her performance. I mean, with the strength and versatility in her singing voice, I just know she's gonna knock this out of the park. She's doing it already. What? That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, I think the backing vocals are by a Jackson 5, one from the original. I could be wrong though. Okay, that whistle note, Mariah Carey would be proud of that.
Oh my gosh. A well-deserved applause right there. I don't even think you understand what you have. <laughs> don't forget to tune into Little Big Shot Sundays at 8, 7 Central, right here on NBC. Was, I think your sister loved it, too. Unbelievable. Unbelievable, honey. We're back right after this. Oh, my gosh. Let me it. Wow. That's just that was, was that eyes belief. Mm-hmm. This is a prime example of why I'm impressed with Angelica. Whenever she performs a song, every time, every single time, if I were the Jackson, if I were anyone from the Jackson 5, I would be proud of her because she did I'll Be There absolute justice. And for the way that she pulled it off with her beautiful, strong, versatile singing voice was just something to be admired. And I'm really impressed with Angelica. The fact that this was from several years ago, and at that time, she's done so much already. I mean, she's been on AGT, Little Big Shots, and became an ambassador for the Kidney Foundation. I actually didn't know about that until now, and several years later, and she's still done a lot between now and then, and I'm just proud of her for that. And not only am I impressed with how she sang the song, I'm also impressed with how confident and how polite she was with the interviewers because she handled the whole thing very well. So all that being said, as always, let me know in the comments what you think. Thank you for watching.